Knockouts out of 49 wins? Uh, 49, no, 43 knockouts. Okay. okay yeah. Yeah. I don't think anybody's done it since, no. right? And he knocked out most of them in the first few rounds. A lot of guys in the first round. And they're bigger than him. He was a small guy. He was only like 5'10 and maybe 185. He knocked out Joe Lewis in like the third or fourth round. Right. Sent him through the ropes. Yeah. Any particular reason he had a 200-pound bag made? Or? Yeah, he decided that if he put 200 pounds and started punching that or knocking that around, he'd be able to knock out his opponent much easier. You know, Rocky said that if anyone works out on this bag for six months, they will knock out any man on the planet with one punch. It doesn't surprise me. A lot of people will say Muhammad Ali is the greatest fighter of all time, but at the end of the day, Muhammad Ali lost fights. How do you beat Rocky Marciano? No one knows because no one ever did. <laughs> well, that's exactly right. You got it right. People will never stop arguing about who's the greatest fighter of all time. And since Rocky Marciano and Muhammad Ali fought in different eras, we'll never know. But Marciano never lost a fight. He was literally unstoppable. You got any paperwork to prove what I do? I do. I do. have affidavits. Well, this is from my father-in-law, John DeGravio. And this one is really nice because it actually talks about how 